welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, you definitely want to subscribe before you leave. I have a lot of exciting things to come and today is also very exciting and it's been pretty highly requested and it's one of my favorite things and that is a Bath & Body Works candle. Um, I have a huge collection of Bath & Body Works candles. I normally splurge and buy them twice a year and when I say splurge, I mean I wait until they go like dirt cheap on sale and then I get a bunch of them. And I mean a bunch of them. I was going through earlier and I was like, do I have 30 Bath & Body Works candles? Yeah, it's that serious. <laughs> Another reason why this video is so exciting is because it's in collaboration with my YouTube bestie, Lori from Graceful and Lovely. She will also be doing a candle collection, but hers will be on multiple brands. If you have not seen her channel before, you are going to fall in love with her. Her home is absolutely gorgeous. She does a lot of home decor hauls. She does DIY projects. You're going to fall in love. So I'm going to link her video up somewhere up here and also in the description box. Like I said, you will love her just as much as I love her. So I'm just going to go briefly through each of them. I have everything from spring, summer, fall, and winter scents. I got it all. And since the semi-annual sale is still going on, I wanted to make sure and go ahead and get this up for you guys. So if you see anything that you might like, you definitely want to head out there and get it. Um, I think right now they are off for 50% off. I don't know how, that's going, how long that's going to last. But um, they do have that $10 off a of 40 coupon, will, which will last until the end of the semi-annual sale. So, with all of that being said, let me shut up rambling. <laughs> and let's go ahead and get into my Bath & Body Works candle collection. Okay, so to get started, we're going to begin with the spring summer scents. Now, it's, it's your prerogative whenever you decide that you actually want to burn these candles. You don't have to burn a summer scent in the summer. You can burn them whenever you feel like you want one to. One of the ombre sort of frosted glass. This is Endless Weekend and I want to say they still have this. Um, the scent for sure, maybe not the frosted glass. I really like how this one smells. I have burned this one. Not very much as you can see, but it says a blend of fresh summer mandarin, creamy vanilla, and blue coconut water that evokes days of sunshine and happiness you wish would never end. And it smells really good and this color goes along with my um, living room decor so I like to leave it out on my sofa table. The last of the ombre glasses, as you can tell I really like these glasses, um, is Black Sands and it says an escape to a dramatic black sand beach with an unforgettable blend of ocean mist and exotic amber finished with creamy cedar wood. So of course this one smells that masculine scent that I love, but it has some of the cleaner ocean, you know, summery scents that's really nice. So definitely suggest these. These do not come with lids, but as you know, I have so many candles, I can put lids on whatever I want. <laughs> and these are actually some that I recently purchased during this semi-annual sale. And we're gonna start with the sugared peony petals. My husband actually picked this out. I was shocked that he grabbed a pink candle. I was so shocked. And it says, treat yourself to the sweet scent of sugared peony petals atop swirls of rich vanilla buttercream. And the reason he picked this one is because, oh, it smells like cotton candy. And I'm like, cotton candy? This doesn't even smell like... I guess it's the sweet scent that he liked, which it does smell good. And I normally don't like floral, but this smells more sweet um, than it does floral. So I really like this one. The next one I recently purchased was Sundress. And... Um, Y'all, this one smells so good. It says a blend of Bright Day Lilies, Tonka Beans, and Bergamot. It's as easy and breezy as a sunny day. And when I tell you, it smells amazing. And the packaging is so adorable. I love this. This will go beautifully in my living room. Another one that I got was the Lemon Verbena. And of course, like it says, it smells like lemon. I love lemon in my kitchen. It says the luscious lemon scent of the plant that grows on country roads in Provence inspired a sunny blend of verbena blossoms and lily of the valley leaves. I really like the way it smells. It's not too strong, but it's just as clean. It's, it's just really nice clean scent. My husband said it reminded him of Pledge, the dusting wipes. He was like, yes, get it. It's, I love that smell. He's so weird. The last one that I just recently purchased was Venice, which is just peach bellini. It's just a different packaging. This one is my favorite peach scent. I don't like the Georgia peach scent. I like the peach bellini. It says, raise your glass to the romantic 
uh, Italian city where the Bellini was invented and enjoys sparkling peach, sweet orange, and mandarin nuts. I love orange. I love anything citrus, so I love how that smells. Another one, I've actually burned this some. It is the Island Margarita. Margarita. And um, I think I recently got this one too. Well, I don't remember. <laughs> the intoxicating scent of sunny lime, sweet mango, and juicy plum with a fresh salted rim. And it does smell really good. I've always liked Island Margarita. I always like getting it in the hand sanitizers. Oh, I love the way this smells. Okay, and um, this one I've had for a little while. And it is the Lemon Mint Tea. I get this every single year. And it says, refreshing spearmint leaves combined with fresh zesty lemon and verbena to delight your senses. And it doesn't smell like tea at all, but it does smell a lot different than the lemon verbena because it does have that spearmint or eucalyptus mint. What is it? Spearmint. And I love spearmint and eucalyptus and peppermint. I love all of those minty flavor, flavors, scents. <laughs> but I love this. I love it in my kitchen. It's just, I, I love lemon scents, but those two are definitely my favorites. Now I'm going to go into some of the scents that I think are kind of any season. You can pretty much do them any any time of the year. Um, and I want to say that they do the, they do have them all throughout the year. They just change the packaging on the outside. So the scent can go along with any time of the year. And the first one is going to be Mahogany Teakwood. Um, lady, go lay down. Go. Go. It's Mahogany Teakwood. The packaging on this is from their fall winter collection. Well, mainly the fall. I want to say I might even have a <laughs> Christmas version. Um, this is one of my all-time favorites. This is probably one of the first candles I ever got from Bath and Body Works when I was probably going into high school. Everybody knows what Mahogany Teakwood smells like. Everybody loves it. And they're all associate with, associated with Amber Crombie and Fitch, the store. It smells like the fierce cologne and it says an autumnal fragrance that offers a harvest of exotic woods, mahogany, cedar wood, oak, and a hint of silvery lavender. It smells so good. If you have not smelled it, you do not know what you're missing out on. If you don't like the more masculine cologne-like scents, you will not like this one. So just go ahead, go about your business. <laughs> the next masculine scent, um, this is the Christmas packaging, but they do have it all year round. And they might even call it something a little different, but it always smells the same. So this one is black tie. And like I said, this is the Christmas packaging. And the lid was really cute this year. But this is more smoky smelling than the mahogany teak wood. So it's got a more depth to its scent. It says your perfect date to any holiday party, green sage, sandalwood, and tonka bean. So right there, it's suggesting, you know, perfect date, smells like a guy, smells like cologne, and it does. And, you know, I suggest burning this all times of the year. It's, it's really great. One of my favorites, I keep this in my bedroom, is the Eucalyptus Spearmint. And this is just from the Stress Relief Aromatherapy line. So you can definitely put this, you know, in any, whatever season it is. It's gonna smell great. Like I said, I love the mint scent. And this is eucalyptus spearmint. And it says eucalyptus essential oil clears the mind while spearmint essential oil uplifts. And it does just what it says. I love this. I could literally sit here all day and smell it. Not even gonna lie. The next candle is one that I actually showed in my last semi-annual sale haul. And it was a sun-drenched vineyard from their wine collection. I cannot explain to you how awesome it smells. This is a full body blend of rich fruit, white wine grapes, and oak. Recalls an unforgettable day at a family run vineyard in Sonoma. Um, love the smell of this, um, of the wine line. Um, but this one was definitely my favorite. Like I said, sun drenched vineyard. Go get your hands on it. I love it. Now we're gonna go into the fall scents. And to get it going, we're gonna go in with flannel. If you love the masculine scents, this is another one that you are absolutely going to fall in love with if you have not already. I didn't even get to burn it last year. I got it after Christmas. I mean, I would burn this all year. Oh, gosh, it smells so good. It says, wrap yourself in a warm blend of bergamot, polished mahogany, and a soft veil of musk. You guys, this smells so good. I might like this one better than Mahogany Teakwood. Just saying, I might, I just might. The next one, of course, is everybody's favorite fall candle, and it is Leaves. 
Um, I got to burn it just a little bit last season. It has such a strong scent of that cinnamon. Ugh crisp apple. Let's see what it's got in here. Celebrate the brilliant colors of autumn with this rich blend of golden nectar, red apple, and spiced berries. I know that spiced has got some, some cinnamon in it and maybe, maybe some nutmeg. Oh, it smells so good. And the spiciness is so strong. It just rings fall. Like I cannot wait to decorate for fall. It's not even 4th of July yet and I'm already ready to decorate for fall. I have a lot of Christmas sea scents. Oh, I do have one more. I have the Marshmallow Fireside. I forgot about this one. I did burn this one quite a bit last year. I love the way this smells. I love it more burning than I do in the jar. So if you don't, if you kind of sort of like it in the jar, you will, you will like it a lot more burning. It says celebrate the season with a warm blend of toasted marshmallows, smoldering woods, and creamy vanilla, reminiscent of a cozy evening around the bonfire. And it is, it's very comfortable smelling, if that even makes any sense. It's just really cozy. I don't think marshmallows have a scent. It's just sort of sweet, but smoldery at the same time. Okay, now we're gonna get into Christmas. And to start off, one of my favorites. I wanna, I might say I actually have, you guys, I actually have a couple different jar of the jars of this so it's fresh balsam if you watch my previous candle hauls then you know i love the smell of trees i could smell them all year long i really could if this just didn't have little glittery trees on the front i would i would burn this all year long it says bring the beauty of the outdoors in with this elegant fragrance that blends evergreen woods crisp eucalyptus and cedar wood and i actually like i said i have two different um packaging <laughs> versions and they both have snowflake lids, but they're just a little different. And they both say the same exact thing. And I think the reason I like this so much is because it has that hint of eucalyptus in it that I love. But you guys, I'm telling you, you cannot go wrong with this. It just reminds me so much of Christmas. It's so clean smelling and so just, ugh. I just, I just want to sing Christmas songs now. Now I want to go watch The Grinch and, and, and Elf and just, just drink hot chocolate. That's exactly what I wanted. We're going to continue with the, the tree scents because <laughs> I got quite a bit of those. This one is Mahogany Balsam. Um, I didn't get to burn it last year because, of course, I picked my favorites over, you know, everything else. But I do have these just in case I run out. <laughs> um, walk through holiday woods with the aromatic fragrance of fresh green balsam, juniper berries, and rich mahogany. I like it. I like it quite a bit. Um... Of course, I don't like anything as much as I like the Fresh Balsam. That is my all-time favorite, but I do like this one. Next one is Snowflakes and Spruce. And I like this one. It's not as tree I guess you would say. It does have more of a fresh scent. This one says, kick off the holiday party season with an outdoorsy blend inspired by snow-capped spruce and sweetened by a touch of creamy vanilla. And it does, I can smell the sweetness of the vanilla in this one. So that's the difference with comparing this to the other tree scents. Here's another one that I have two in <laughs> and that is Tis the Season. I have two completely different jars of Tis the Season. This says, Rich red apples, green pine, and a touch of golden cider combined to capture the joy of the season. Oh, it smells so good. Let's smell the one that I haven't burnt. Mmm. It's, it's got that cinnamony smell like leaves does. Um, but you know, it's got, it's got some other stuff in it. Next is one of my all-time favorite scents, and I love it in the body wash, the lotion, hand sanitizer. Um, wallflowers you name it I love it and I probably got it but this is the winter candy apple and it says a sweet yuletide blend of candied apples and spiced orange zest with a touch of winter musk oh my gosh this brings back so many memories because I'm telling I've wore the body the body care for years and then when they came out with a candle I was just like yes Jesus yes okay next is one of my favorite scents that they came out with last year and they might have had it before i just never seen it or smelled it um but i bought it in everything i bought it in everything once i smelled it because i love it that much 
and it is peace and technically it is iced vanilla woods so you know how they'll throw a name on there and it's actually this you know they'll just repackage it but it says enjoy a, a, a peaceful holiday with this soothing blend of sweet vanilla smoldering woods and iced lavender it smells it smells so good it's got that woodsy scent, but it's sweet and it has that lavender, fresh, clean scent. Oh, I love this. Next up is winter. Ooh. <laughs> I forgot how much I love this one. Okay, a fragrance that captures the moment when glittering icicles and sparkling snow transform the landscape. Pine needles, icy mandarin, and winter woods. I told you I love oranges. I told you I love trees. And you know that I love the woodsy, I, wo I love the woodsy masculine scent. And this has all three of them in it. Oh my, it's got that depth of the woodsy scent. It's got the cleanness of the, of the mandarin. And then those pine, the pine needle. Oh, the, just the, I don't even know how I can explain the way trees make me so happy. Just the scent of them. I don't know. I'm not a tree hugger or anything, but I mean, ugh, winter, you guys. I know they don't have any Christmas scents out right now, but you will be prepared when the season comes around. Because if they're anything like Hobby Lobby, Hobby Lobby has already started taking their Christmas decorations out, okay? I thought it was crazy when I seen their fall decorations and started seeing pumpkins everywhere, but no, candy canes, ribbon, stockings, they're putting it out. So, be on the lookout for these candles. It'll be up tomorrow. You wait. <laughs> yes, um, we have spiced apple toddy. You know, the name gives it away. It's a spiced apple. And, you know, you can already tell I like the, the apple cinnamony scent. And it says a sweet mixture of winter fruits, apple brandy, and spiced plum will warm up all of your winter celebrations. Mm. And last but not least is sparkling icicles. I did actually burn this a little bit last year. And it has that masculine scent. It says, let your holiday party sparkle with this bright fragrance of moss, bergamot, and a finishing touch of citrus. As always, you know I love citrus. Mm -hmm. It's not as deep smelling as winter because winter has the pine needles in it. So that's what the difference is. But they do both have that citrusy woodsy scent so they do have similarities but the pine needle in this one's a lot strong so it's a deeper smell than this one is but they both smell really good i like them both okay guys so that is all i am literally surrounded in candles <laughs> that is all for this bath and body works candle collection i do have a few more candles that aren't bath and body works um, so if you're interested in seeing those, just comment down below and I'll let you know. Um, I actually do buy, you know, some Walmart candles, some DW Homes candles, which I get from Target, and just some different name brand candles. Um, but I just so happen to have quite a bit of Bath and Body Works candles because they are definitely my favorite. Um, if you have any video ideas for the future, as always, definitely comment those down below. If you like seeing Bath and Body Works videos or candle videos definitely hit the like button so i know that you like seeing it and i will definitely make sure and keep it up for you guys so i hope you guys enjoyed and as always have a beautiful blessed day <laughs>